weren't worried about me. We were welcome. One moment. Think about it. One second. Okay. I'm coming. Please. Please. Consider the fact that I am coming over here. You won't. Okay. Hello. Welcome back, everyone. Um. Welcome. We're playing some of that good stuff. You know it. You. You wish it. It's freaking Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, baby. Maybe wake up a little bit. Look around. Look around, motherfucker. Stop! Anyways. Stop! Hello there. How y'all doing? How y'all really doing, huh? Uh. Let me go ahead and pop this baby open. Pop this baby open. Is it a bye bye or a boo bye? Well, it was. Buh, bye. Which I think is why you think I say buh. Because I don't say buh. But le uh, lately it's been an boo bye. So, it's never bye bye. That's a little boy. That's a little kid. That's a little man. That's what you would say. I am more of a buh bye. Buh bye or boo bye. Kill that to woman. Call her on Discord right now. I'll say, You listen here, you motherfucking bitch! You listen here, Sangily Angelus! <laughs> Let's see. It's Bye bye or Boo bye. Never bye bye. Oh, so welcome. Hello. Yeah, I eat the monster rose cheese. Hello. Mm. The Society of Leopold. We need to find a way to get inside and locate him. Mozzarella. Mozzarella. Yep. See, it's hard because you have to hold it with one hand and peel it with the other, so it's like, uh, I can't move. I can't do anything. Help me. Uh. How's it going, little finger? Is it string cheese? It's string cheese. I mean, I know I could just like pull on, take a bite out of it, you know. Like I don't have to string it. In fact, that's what I'm gonna do. You know those people who get like a Kit Kat bar and they're like, they just take a whole bite out of it instead of breaking it. Breaking off the wafers. And that's basically what I'm doing right now. <laughs> okay. Cheese is in my mouth. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> okay. Imagine it like this, okay? Cheese, if you please. Thank you. On your knees. All right. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, shit. My water is fucking to the brim once. Hey. <clears throat> there we go. Alright, welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. I think we're extremely close to the end of the game. But, uh, what I'm going to do is go back here and find the thing. I can go bring it to Pisha, and then she'll give me the final artifact, and then I'll be like, whoa! That fucking cheese. What would you do if someone said, no cheese for the rest of your life? 
You're now lactose intolerant. How would you react? Mm. Merge moment. Listen, I don't sound like that. I don't fucking sound like that. Oh my fucking god. I am lactose intolerant. It doesn't stop me. <laughs> no. Don't. No, you can't go that far. No. Nope. Big lies. You're a big liar. You really gonna be like, yeah, nah, yeah, nah, it's... <clears throat> no, I don't think so. I don't think so. You would be dead if you ate cheese and also lactose intolerant. Lack, lacking toes intolerant. Thank you. Excuse me. The fuck? Oh, there's still people over here. Hey, did you not hear that I'm walking here? What's up, motherfucker? But this weapon sucks. What about this one? Dude, this weapon sucks too. What the freaky heck? There we go. I will eat cheese until it makes me shit myself, and I'll eat more. <laughs> Why? It's not good for your intestines. Intestines are probably like. He's trying to kill us! Help! <laughs> ah, what the fuck? Classic, classic me hard oh, moment. There you go. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada ba boom. Bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. Maybe I should play Sims 4 for the early stream after this. Capture that wave of Sims 4 players that's happening right about now. There's a lot of people who are like, ah, oh, Sims 4. I think it came out for free on Steam or something like that. Excuse me? Excuse-moi. Excuse-moi, me petit chérie. Thank you. I don't know what I just said in French. I'm not even sure I said anything in French. But I did say something with my mouth. I think that's what matters most. In this dire and complex world of our errors. Thank you. A single teardrop runs down my eye as I cry. <laughs> yeah, get yoinked on. Yeah, I didn't even need this last time. The whole pulling the sword stuff. Some guy came out there and was like, Ooga, booga, booga. It did come out for free on Steam. See? I gotta... I gotta freaking capitalize. I gotta be like, ah, ooga booga booga. Hello, everyone. It is me, little boy. I'm here to say hello. Error. I'm telling you. It's what is needed now in this world. Where's my... Where's my fucking... Where is it? Lock picking is at a six. So anything that highlights that. I don't think there's anything else I can really do. Because this is at its full amount, so I can't really buy into it. Uh, 
Oh, there it is. Dexterity. Quack! Wait a second. That didn't do anything. Wait, what? Cancel. Go back in. Ah, oh, there we are. Now it's up to seven, which still isn't enough. Shit. Sims 4. Sims 4. Oh god, did I just try and lockpick the door to this place? Uh, ugh. 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 Dude, what is this? There's no freaking thing I'm gonna jig around here. Go we'll check all the rooms. This is some garbage. This is some bullshit. They're supposed to look. Look, 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 look. Keisha wants you to find two occult items and bring them back to her. One of them is a fetish in the museum, and the other is a book located in the Giovanni mansion. Is it the book that I already have? Vampires uh, might not need glasses, but they do need hooked on phonics. Would this be the book? I... This would be like the place for books, right? Right? Understandably? Fuck is it? This not the book? Is this not the book? The good book of religion? Yeah, I'm religion here. Yeah, I'm religioning here. Maybe this is the book. I don't know. We'll go bring it to her. And she says, Ooga booga, ooga booga. And then I'll say, whatever. I'm gonna go get that one boy. Need a ride? Yeah. Take me back to downtown. And then we'll go get the scientist man, and he'll say, Oh, this is a book. Or this is a... And Karin Sarkanga, I guess. And then I'll clap my hands. Alright. Let's go see if she takes the bait, baby. Thank you. Hello, little woman. Hello, woman. There you go. Yes. Uh. What the items you want? Yes. Tell me about the book. It is used to communicate with certain entities otherworldly. It is a tome called the Voce del Morte. Should you find yourself within the walls of the Giovanni, seize the opportunity and take it, for they will make sure you never have another. <laughs> if I find it, I'll bring it by. No. Yes. We get nothing. Goodbye. Well, f back. This isn't the correct book at all. <laughs> I don't know where the book would be. Then I went through that entire mansion, did I not? I said, "Mansion, mansion, full of delight. Show me the way of blight." Thank you. All right. Well, so much for all that. Uh, we have seven hundred and seventy dollars. Which is nice. Uh, what I'm going to go do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to Up go in. to Singh's shop back in Chinatown. And then we'll go to the Society of Leopold. We'll go shoot up the place. We'll go crazy and shoot up the place. Like, really shoot it up. Thank you. 
<laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Hello, sir. Welcome back. Yeah, I need that good shit. Thanks, dog. Thanks, bro. Desert Eagle. Point seventy. My God. My God. Fifteen. Sixty-six dollars for that. Why is it so goddamn much, huh? Eh. That's fifty-four dollars. Oh my God. Oh, that's two hundred and forty-four for a bush hook. It's only slightly better than the sledge, so I'm good. Magazine holds seven. Okay. Just trying to. I'm just trying to thank you, okay, people. Is this even worth it compared to this? Maybe it's not. Hello. Hello, Jelly Melly. Welcome. How are you doing? I do need this a little. This. Ranchy. Ranchy space. That costs a little bit more. My money, my money goes down the drain and I go, oh. <laughs> Looking for someone to amuse me on Twitch. I believe that was what you said last time you came here. I said, hey, how you doing? And you said, looking for someone to amuse me on Twitch. Oh, welcome. Have, uh, has your journey been well in finding that person to amuse you? Have you found anyone lately? There we go. Get that nice and reloaded. Damn, it's a big fatty gun. You succeeded the last time, so here I am again. I wouldn't count it on uh, count on it each time. I'm just one little man. There we go. Now, now it's reloaded. All right. We're good to go. We're off to go kill some people. LOL! Welcome back! Here you go, you could have this book. I don't really need this book. Below my abilities, bitch. Alright. Without a further ado, let's go go go. I think you did. Well thank you. I appreciate that. If you like shooting, we're about to do a lot of it. <laughs> a lot. Going somewhere. Go on, take me to the Society of Leopold, baby. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna go sneaking <laughs> and freaking. We got rocks of all the shapes and sizes. There's a man over there, and he says, I'm bald. Greetings, soldier. Anything to report? The Gladius Day has told us to keep a sharp eye. He thinks we may have some visitors this evening. Of course, sir. But duty, as always, is to protect the Brotherhood. All sir. seems quiet for now. Good, good. Did he mention... Uh, what kind of visitor, sir? The only kind that matters, soldier. Yes, sir. Of course, sir. Carry on. The only kind that matters, soldier. Carry on, soldier. Soldier! What? Uh oh. I think this is the correct way, right? Unless you are the guy who listened, listened to some schmuck to do something very unamusing. Are you saying that you listen to anyone being like, yeah, what's up? Can you, can you do a big a funny sound effect with your butt? They do it that those people are a little less funny, a little less amusing because they appeal to the masses or they take commands like a filthy little dog. <laughs> Let me inside this building. Please. 
okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Whoop. I meant taking a command to go AFK on a club. <laughs> I've never heard of that, but that's fair enough. Lord, I pray now that you give me strength in battle, that I might overcome the horns of Satan and his children, that I might uh, the flame power. of the sword of the archangel and defend myself. This man really do be praying while I'm over here being like, I'm hacking into your computer. And if I meet death tonight, then let it be first that I cast a host of demons back into the lake of fire once they came, and then respite will find This man really has freaking... This man really do be a little crazy, man. Oh, wait. Watch this. You ready for a power move right here, everyone? Okay, and then the heat dig will be human. Oh, not human. It'll be human. All right. Bring to this bitch! Bada <laughs> yeah, That's kind of fucked. Man, they're just taking damage over there or something. I, I think. Uh, good thing it wasn't you. Yes. Good thing it wasn't me. What's your favorite type of ice cream, everyone? Thank you. We're doing pretty good. I remember the last time I did this, I was like flopping like a fish all over the place. Uh, eat sig, stock. Human. There you go. Are we good? I like penis butter. Why would you say this? Care to explain your intrepidation? Care to explain yourself? What's happening over there? Ugh. Was that me? I thought I was set to human. Shush everyone, okay? Man, all of this to just stop a little vampire like me. That guy literally just walked past me. It was like, Logers, Logers, bye. Inventory full. <laughs> what is that? First try. First try. Emote. Emote. I wish I could eat more in real life. Who's there? Who's there? What? What? Stop right! What the, f the heck is going on? <laughs> How did I get caught? Look at this guy. He's like, yeah, I know you're there. What's up? Yeah. Ow. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> hey, listen, listen, okay? We're cool. I like that though. Very, very good time. I, I do enjoy that they're like, yeah, we're gonna go crazy on you. Uh, this is inscribed with the initials GB. We have tracked LaCroix to Los Angeles. He has made his lair in the penthouse of the Venture Tower, hiding behind some legitimate business front, while commanding his legion of demons by cover of night. I prayed to the Lord for strength in the coming days, but, uh, were you... Sorry, there's a cat in front of me. Uh, there you go. Uh, but there is a shadow that hangs over my heart like the dark wings of Lucifer himself. It is not LaCroix, I fear, not his underlings, but there is a fear in my heart nonetheless. An ancient evil is stirring. May God grant me the strength to overcome it. 
Oh, man. That went too fast. Uh, we finally found the lair of Alistair Grout, but it seems we were too late. The demon had already been sent to hell before I was able to dispatch him. I ran across a younger vampire who seemed unaware of Grout's demise. No doubt he, uh, one of his sucklings come to visit its master. I took care of that demon and destroyed the house. I thank God for his eternal watchfulness over me and the Brotherhood. Uh, there seems a great unrest among the vampire brood here in the city. Um, perhaps the arrival of LaCroix was unwelcome to the rest of the damned? I know not, nor do I care. They will all burn. Hello? Are you ready? Oh my God! <laughs> It's a freaking raid. Wow, thanks for poo -poo -poo being viewers. Hello, welcome. Uh, there it is. You're making me sneeze. I'm allergic. I'm allergic to meanies. Thank you. <laughs> uh, they will all burn, whether by my hand or the father's. And Karin's sarcophagus was stolen today from the Museum of Natural History. The police report was obtained. Uh, we obtained leads me to believe that the demon spawn were behind it. The book uh, I received yesterday from the Vatican only reinforces that theory. I know now that these very well be the end times and the times of the final struggle will be upon us. I dreamed of LaCroix last night of his hideous visage burned to ash and great inferno. May it. Uh, may it be that this is a vision given to me by God, and that I will be the vessel of this holy vengeance. Uh, the years have been long, too long. Perhaps the soul of my father finally rests in peace. Brother Krieger, blah, 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 whatever. I took Johansson from his hotel room last night, even, uh, last night evening, and brought him here to the monastery. I am convinced that LaCroix will try to find him as he is the only one with the knowledge of how the artifact can be opened. The brethren have been warned to expect an assault on the monastery, and they are ready to die for his glory. As am I. May the Holy Father bless us in these last dark days, and may the children of Satan burn forever in the hellfires of the damnation. Amen. Thank you. Raid! <gasps> Thank you. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. St. Gilly, if I was to do... Sims 4 for the early stream. What what would you think? What would you think? Would you say, oh that's that's neat. Neat neat. Thank you. Sock. Oh, I would think that's cool. Okay. Cause I've been thinking maybe that's what I will do. Then I'll freaking put everyone in it. Wait. Oh. There we go. It's gonna be so freaky epic, trust me. Hey, I know you're out here. Where you people at? Imagine being a dead. Uh oh, I'm in frenzy mode. Yeah, I frenzy. What about it? I don't even know why I frenzied. Man, this desert eagle cray cray. Uh. I gotta switch over to the normal gun. <laughs> they all got... They all went crazy. They said, what the hell, man? <laughs> man, I go crazy when I kill people like this. I fucking... This is me? This is me at JustiCon versus you are. You're like, we gotta kill the damned soul! And I'm like, LOL! LOL! Get freaking shot upon, LOL! I feel like this is very accurate. Very, very accurate to, uh... What would be the truth? <gasps> wow.
There it is, the Ankaran Sarcagagagagagus. Actually, I don't know if that is. Vampir Acrophobia. Uh. Vampir Acrophobia. 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 This book is titled Vampir Acrophobia. Uh, unidentified sarcophagus discovered by Julius of Gaul, uh, 1068. Uh, near Ankara Ottoman Empire. The origin of this dark and mysterious talisman is largely unknown and is mostly considered a myth, if not for the etching of Julius of Gaul, who first discovered it and then subs uh, subsequently uh, re-entombed the artifact. There would be almost no historical record of the artifact, save for various unfounded legends of its evilness scattered throughout the writings of the Brotherhood. Uh, historians and theologians alike uh, have been unable to ascertain its exact age or place of origin, although the symbols and inscriptions seem to hint that the artifact is from the area of ancient Sum uh, Sumer or Meso uh, Mesopotamia. Uh, it has never been opened, and therefore any myths pertaining to who or what might be encased in it are total speculation. Vampiric origins have not been ruled out, although many scholars within the church seem to think that it may hold the remains of an ancient king, whose name so far has been lost to the ages. Uh, let it be said, though, that the writings of Julius Gaul mm, describe the artifact as being a nefarious and dread thing, full of some ancient and undeniable evil. He attributes the death of his scribe to the artifact, who, upon setting his eyes on it, for the first time began convulsing uncontrollably and promptly died. I checked out my VOD. Only two small portions have been muted, so that's pretty cool. That's why I never play music, because I always, I'm always all like, oh, what if it mutes my, my VOD? Well, that's good. Glad it didn't get super duper canceled by the super duper Twitch bot. But yeah, I think SimStream could be fun. I would make all of you as I believe you to be. It would be so cool. I'd be like, here we are. Look, it's all of you. And y'all look like shit. LOL! <laughs> I think that'd be pretty good, right? Dude, that's some bullshit. Battle mods can only make uh, eight people. I mean, let's be honest, that's about as many as uh, who tune into my streams, you know? Let, let's be for real. Make me first. I don't think you, I don't think you guys are gonna want what I make you. you be like, whoa, just he's playing the game. And then I'm gonna make it, make it, we're gonna make y'all look so freaking wretched. It'll be so cool. You all will say, wow, I hate this. And I hate you now, Justy. I think you should make him so first. He's the main character. Do you guys put yourself into the game? Last time I played, I, I didn't have myself in it. I was like, well, I'm the big man in the sky, so... You know. There's no real need for me to be in the game. But I guess it would be, uh helpful to have some kind of like hey this is this is how it is hey gimme give gimme give power up up there you go no, this isn't what I wanted. Ah! Yeah, I like that. I like when it's like, yeah. Let me in my fucking door. Thank you. Jeez. Uh. Yeah, but I don't really make it accurate. To me. Fair enough. Maybe I'll do that. I'll say. Everyone, speedy jumpsty. 
It's a version of a jump steam. Maybe I'll make a very exaggerated version. Man, I'm gonna have to remember how to install some mods or something like that. It's gonna suck. But it should be cool as long as someone tunes in and says, Wow! Cool stream, bro. Just imagine we'll have everyone interacting. It'll be so cool and so great. Uh, where the hell do I go? Hello? I assume it's right through this door, but it's not. Welcome to Justy is lost forever. I think it's a good idea. Could be funny. I think it's at least a little bit like ah oh, viewer appreciation. Look, I made you guys in video game. Ooh. You all can clap your hands now. Just these lost. What's new? I don't like being killed. Personally, never did. Never will. This man's awful. Awful man. Literally scumbag of the year. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Oh, that do be a piece of paper. Would maybe suggest getting a free legal version with all packs, etc. Now nah, I'm gonna get the version off of Origin. I'm gonna say, look, everyone, this is my legal copy, and it only has like one of the two packs. Whoa! Or maybe I should. I don't know. That's the only reason why I really keep the Origins on my uh, desktop. But you know. I don't know, then again, <laughs> downloading like a whole version of the game with all the packs, it's like, good luck. You'll be dead by the time it's done downloading. I don't know, I don't have to take a look. But everything else is not. I have to, I'll have to take a look. What the fuck is this guy? Society, Becky once you find Professor Johansson who has been held at the Society of Leopold, you'll need to find a way to get inside and locate him. Ugh. BB. Took Johansson from his hotel room last evening and brought him back here to the monastery. I am convinced that LaCroix, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Uh, I had dreams of fires at Griffith Park last evening. I know not their origin, but I fear the worst. I received a letter from His Holiness warning me that he is fearful that the apocalypse is upon us and that my mission has become more important than ever. I hold his uh, words close to my heart and will fight for righteousness until I am no longer able. The fuck do I go? Should I go? Should I just look it up? I'm just gonna look it up. <gasps> they have her, the mass core raid bloodlines. Uh, Johansson. Where do I find them? Lady of Leopold. Oh. Here, I'll just watch someone else play it real quick. LOL! The RPG chick. That's, that's her name. Okay, I'm just watching. What the fuck? This person just used magic. Like that sound. Just inherently dislike. 
Man, am I watching Singuli Anima? Lol! You mean my packs? You could technically log in on my EA and use my packs. I bought a lot of them. Or even knew you, bro. <laughs> nah, I'm good. I'll just. I'll just do my own and I'll say Ooga Booga Ooga Booga. I'll say Ooga La Booga. There you go, everyone. Did you give me any cognition, any reason to grab that? Nah. <laughs> no. Hi. Hello, you go on a bob. You go on a bob. How do you feel about Sims 4? Sims 4. 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 Thank you. Oh, boy. We gotta take advantage of the sneak while we have it. Well, so much for the sneak while we have it. BAM! I freaking go crazy, I go crazy! Thank you. I haven't played Sims 4. That's understandable. But now I hope you know you're on a wanted list. And you'll be hunted down by every woman ever known to have lived. You're now on a hit list. How am I able to do this? I don't know. <laughs> I punted him into the other guy. Ow. Ow. <laughs> yeah, baby. Suck him up. Sorry. I think it might be a bit like Sims 2 or 3. I also haven't played, except for that Sims 2 pets thing. I told you about that the other day. I don't think you did. What? You didn't tell me about that, you little liar. You little freaking geek. I think my favorite version was Sims 2 for the PlayStation 2 because it was the least like sims game ever because you actually had to go around and solve some issues and form relationships with people and then it was like okay here's a big overarching story lol and i said lol thank you lol so that's just my humble opinion hashtag humble hashtag graced hashtag beautiful thank you I open my heart to you and you act like it don't exist because it don't You're a vampire You're a freaking vampire and I know this I know your type You're only here for the free ride bitch Just gotta hit them with them lols, you know? Then they can't really do much. Merry Christmas, everyone. No more, no more, no more f fire. No fire. Ash? You. It ruined my face. The fire. I can still feel it in my wounds. They'll kill me. They'll come back with their brands and it will burn. I bet it will. You look horrible. They talk so they burn me. Again. And again. And again. Their eyes. They, they enjoyed it. 
Before they come back, I'm begging you, let me out. I'll look for a way. Got something that may heal up a few of those wounds. I once drank from the most desirable women in the world. Right now, this bag looks better than any of them. Wow. Don't go anywhere, I'll be back. Oh. There's a lock picket. Okay. We gotta go find a key for the man. He'll be free. Don't worry, Ash. I'll get you out of there, man. Even though, you know, kind of just there. I don't even know how. <laughs> I don't even know how he got here, but okay. Vampires have hearts. What else would you impale with a stake? With a, a steak? Like a nice juicy piece of meat? Well, I imagine you couldn't really impale anything with a juicy piece of meat, so... You know, I, I'm not too sure on that. <laughs> now a steak, a S-T-A-K-E, now that might be a bit different. Wrong with these boys. Ammo full. I like this French. This freaking what is it? What should I call it? Not French. What's the musical device? past this part hey what's up boys what's up boys can't help but go rear 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 well at least <laughs> at least they gave up uh, now I have to go back and free him Son of a bitch man really causing my life full of strife bitch well, acting like you ever killed one. You're acting like I never did kill one. Freaking the heck, man. Why don't you calm down? Act on all high and mighty. You don't have anything to be proud of, little bitch. Thank you. Don't worry, I'm sniping like a little sniper over here. Did I get him? <laughs> ah. Sir! Dude, what the hell is this? I think I finally got him. <laughs> Oop, there goes your spinal cord. Oop. I'll be your be. Gotta go find something to eat. Go get yourself something tasty. Shut the fuck up. I will kill your blood and then pet your cat. Yeah, well, I'll kill your Sims 2 character and your Sims 2 cat, bitch. Fucking little tizzer. You think you're so high and mighty. You think you're all over the place. You think you're cool. You think you're epic. But you're not. You're just a fool. Well, that is a lot of people who are now after me. Here, I have an idea. Don't worry. Oh, 
my god. That was not even part of my plan, so... Wow, what a fun, awful gun. Why would anyone ever use this? this fucking horrible. Pretty sure that guy just shot his friend right there. This is awful. Why would anyone fucking use this? Yeah, I like not being able to shoot low. Good two bullets of damage. Great. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm good. I'll just use pistols. At least I can hit them somewhat. Low. Imagine me. Imagine me, if you will. Killing all of everybody. <laughs> Thank you. Get freaking killed upon. Bitch. Thank you. Anyways. Uh... People, 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 people. Thank you. All right. Good enough for me. Third played CS Source. Uh, I think I tried once and then I was like, lol. I'm good. I'm not good at this. Bye. Probably what happened. More than likely. Uh, what do you think of Sims 4? I don't really like the Sims games. I don't really see them as, uh, enjoyful. That's just me. Thanks. You'll never see me again. I'm gonna go somewhere no one will ever see this face again. Don't expect another rescue. Good luck in Canada. Lol. He's become a Canadian citizen. My eye. Ah, my eye. Yeah, I like when my eyelashes are so freaking long they start jabbing into my eyeball. I think I'm good. Okay. We're good, baby. What up, baby? All right. We freed Ash, and now we're gonna go and kill some people. It'll be pretty cool, so make sure to watch in your 3D glasses, everyone. Make sure to put on your 3D glasses now. Right now. Right now. <laughs> so true. So true. Uh oh. Hello, it's me, little boy. You missed. I knew your Hansen would lure the servants to safety, but I set this type as the arch thief himself. Where is Lacroix? <sighs> You're wasting your breath, mortal. I'll drain your body. Grants and uh, Lacroix. You think Lacroix would cover your loan? Perhaps when Lacroix runs out of minions, he will show me his face, and God will guide my shots through it. Before I send you to eternal damnation, any last words? You are the one who will be singing the last words. Know your place, mortal. Come bow in front of me. When I get done with you, even see. Peter would recognize you. Thanks for God's 
mercy. I will show you none. You'll be begging me to kill you after I rip out your guts. Love, love. Run the field, Bach. Ow. Is this it? Can I just walk up to him and start shooting his ass? Probably gonna pull out the Desert Eagle. He teleports, what the fuck? He's using God to shield him. Man, he really do be putting up his little holy shield. Every time I shoot him with a bullet. Ow. God damn, he teleporting. Ah, fuck. Where'd he go? We're fine, we're good. Ah, come on. He was using his freaking his religion buff. Whatever. We're cool. We're fine, basically. Bet you would play the, if someone paid you thousand dollars. You hypocrite. No. I don't like Sims. Sims is not enjoyable. It's like any other popular game I played. I could I could have kept playing it forever. That just ain't me. I need difference in my life. I'm not in it for the money, honey. In fact, if I had it my way, there'd be no subscription. There'd be no resubscription. People would just be able to play Cool funny sounds and cool little emotes forever. Remington 1700 beep, 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 beepers. I'm gonna go ahead and drop this. Even though it's probably worth a fuck ton of money. Thanks, big boy. Alright, bye. Are you making fun? No, I'm being for real. I don't need money. I just want the benefits of having more emotes, more animated emotes. I don't want the money. I feel like it turns this from a hobby or something to enjoy more into a job. And I don't like that. That's just me personally. I told you everything. There's no reason for you to keep me here. Let me go! Shut up. Tell me what you know about the Ankar and Sarcophagus. I am an archaeologist. You can't hold me here like this. I am a hostage. I do not need protection. Bring me back to my hotel at once. So down, Gramps, or I'll give you something to really be afraid of. I am an old man. How can you threaten me like this? Do you have a conscience? Just let me go. I have a wife and children. I want to see them again. Help me. Uh, it's a big question. There's no reason for me to hurt you. Yeah, yeah, okay. Anything, just get me out of these caverns and away from these crazies. I think I'm starting to get pneumonia. <coughs> Tell me what you know about the Ankar and Sarcophagus. The Sarcophagus? You went through all that trouble for the sarcophagus? Yeah, I'll tell you. But don't you think it would be better to get out of here before those men come back? I dealt with them. They won't give you any problems. I guess if you can get all the way here, you deserve the answers. 
But can I make one request first? After I answer your questions, you will help me escape. Sure. All right. Where should I begin? What can you tell me about the sarcophagus? Let's start with the history of the Ankaran sarcophagus. That is a long and interesting legend, lost and found throughout the ages. Tell me, are you familiar with the Assyrians? Spare me the, all the bullshit. How do I open it? Ah, quite interesting. There is a surprisingly complex mechanical lock on the face of the sarcophagus. By sheer luck, we were able to find the key not far from the sarcophagus. Why no one ever found it and robbed it? It's perplexing. A key, of course. Do you have it? How strange, you would ask. I haven't seen the key since it was loaded onto the Elizabeth Dane in Turkey. To Syria. It was stolen <laughs> before the sarcophagus serious. season. Syria is serious. I am still hopeful that the police find both pieces before the contents can be disturbed. You have a copy of the key? No, it's not the kind of key you can copy at the hardware store. It's actually very sophisticated, and I meant to study it at the museum. I've answered all your questions. Do you think now you could please get me out of here? I don't care who you are or why you've had so many questions about the sarcophagus. I just want to leave this place. Sir, I'm afraid you know too much. But you said you'd let me go. Lol, 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 lol. Hey, it is what it is. You know what I mean? Listen, okay. You think I wanted to do that? Of course. Oh. <laughs> Oh shit, I gotta go! See ya, dog! Oh, I got stuck on the railing. Wow, look at all this rumbling. Look at all this rumbling. You go. See, it's a good thing I killed all those men before. Now I can run straight to the boat that I saw and get the heck out of here. Celerity does not help the uh, timer, even though that should make sense. Get the heck out of here. Well, that's what happens when you live by the by the way of God, then you die, bitch. Thanks. What? Merry Christmas. What the fuck? What with all the rubble here? Good evening to you. The hell's happening here? Uh, I guess I better go up. Tell the boy what's happening. Tell him, hey, hey, it's a wonderful kind of day. Oh, it is not a wonderful kind of day at all. Well, that's a lot of dead people, actually. Where the hell is Chunks at? Bro, was Chunks a villain the whole time? I bet you anything. Why are you heading up? Dude, why are all those buttons all lit up? Hello? <laughs> With whom do they think they're dealing? Attack me in my own building! They're desperate. <laughs> They've shown their weakness. A last ditch attempt to steal the prize. Is it last ditch? Or is it last stitch? Oh, made a mess downstairs. The Sabat, a pack of shovelheads with cheap pistols was all they could muster. Two got a few stories up, but I took care of them. 
and my sheriff brought the rest their final death in the lobby. Sabat animals. Fair enough. Sabat attacked why? So we don't have to worry about the spy anymore? Why'd what? they attack? The motive of every kindred in the entire city these last few nights. The Ankaran sarcophagus. They've been misled into thinking the sarcophagus holds a sleeping ancient. Their most coveted feasts. Diablerists. Oh, one second, I'm getting a call. Beer me. Boogly boogly. Hello. Hey there. Hello. A monkey on the loose. It's Apescape, bro. Diabloritis. The Sabbat's infamy is in no small part due to their practice of diablery. That is, drinking the blood of other kindred. Especially oh older ones. Until they are dead. Diablerists gain the power of those they've fed upon. And the Camarilla. This is an act punishable by death. For the moment, we've manipulated the press into reporting tonight's events as a terrorist attack. Their soldiers may be no danger to me, but their threat to the masquerade is abundant. As my best agent, I'm sure you can guess my course of action. <laughs> when, when, you know, when it's anything you can't explain, just say it's terrorist. The end. Uh, monkey on the loose. Did you catch it? And no, I don't have my ape escape license or the time net or the travel net. <sighs> Sorry, I drink water. Yeah, that's right. I'm one of those types that drinks water. Uh, well, Sabat? Oh, the Sabat yeah. have made their haven <clears throat> at the Hallibrook Hotel. Right under our noses here in downtown. Kill their leader. The rest will scamper out of the city. This is the last time they ever set foot in Los Angeles. Before you go, Beckett told me you went to the Society of Leopold. Did you find out how my sarcophagus is opened? Yes, I did. What? What did you find out? 
The missing crate from the Dane, it's a key to the sarcophagus. A key? Where? Do you have it? No, that's all I know. I have other good news. Bach is dead. <laughs> Not only did you infiltrate the Society of Leopold, but you managed to kill their greatest hunter. You certainly are developing a legend for yourself. Yeah, Superb. see? A toast to you, and to victory over the Sabbat. And to Bach. May all his progeny meet such fates. I agree. Any hunters that cross my path are dead. Same goes for the Sabbat. Yeah. The Sabbat must be wiped out before dawn. I'm a good little dog. Then, when you come back, we'll begin the hunt for the key. Uh, okay. I, I just finished eating some stuff. I'm sorry if I was rude or something before. <laughs> what? You can always count on I can't ever tell if you're JK and me, right Iguana Bob, or if you're for They're real, reckless, real. But they don't normally try to attract this much attention. You a silly boy, though. Carelessness warrants observation. I hope it doesn't become I always pandemic. get hungry as well. Hangry, as they say, I believe. It's the number one reason why I'm such a grump all the time. Because I'm like, I need food. Uh. Who cares? I'm going to wipe them out anyway. Well, perhaps for this pack, it's for the best. Yeah, I met with Dr. Johansson. What did Johansson have to say? I mean, Johansson, something about a key and... Ah, oh, stop, I'm old. <laughs> the lock and key. An invention as ancient as greed. I should have guessed. All we have to do is find a victor in this nonsense. They'll be the one with the key. Uh, I told the prince the important stuff. I had another question. Excellent. I spoke of Ganahina before. Uh, nah, I'm good. Anyways, why would the Sabat attack so it's openly? It's simple. Someone's misled them into believing there's an antediluvian in this very room. They, and I suspect most kindred in this city, would love to sink their stakes or teeth into its imagined occupant. If indeed rocketing it to the moon was out of the question. Hey, prepare for my assault. Goodbye. Hey, can Wipe I get some them cash? Before they doom us all. I just want some cash, please. I did eat some toast and some even with chorizo and cheese. Ooh, chorizo and cheese. Isn't chorizo cheese? Or am I thinking of something else? Chorizo is like, yeah, we got chorizo. Yeah, we're chorizo. Yeah, I'm a chorizo. Yeah, I chorizo. The only thing. I'm looking for, uh. I like how I haven't increased any of my, like, actual <laughs> good stuff. Firearms, baby. Boom! I now kill! It's a sausage, I think. Spanish. Oh, yeah, you're right. Never mind. There's something else. There's, like, a mix of, like, cheese and something else. I don't know. It tastes really good. It tastes really damn fine. What's my cash looking like? Dude, what the fuck? Why do I only have 400 cash? Eh. This is some stupid shit, bro. At least I don't have to go far to go kill some sabat. Sabat ba bop. Ba 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 ba. Apparently they're here. I think it's that one place. The red sun and all that. Maybe. Who knows? Hey, lady, can I get some cash? Money, right? Been a while. Your money's been piling up. Here, that should provide for an interesting evening. Hey, thank. Oh my! Oh. Sucks, bro. Five hundred dollars. Oh. Do you ever get mad when people don't talk too much about the game? Uh. What, if I'm like watching someone, Goody, nice night out. or if I'm streaming it and people don't talk about it, I don't ever really get mad in either case. But I feel as the streamer, 
I have to talk about it. Try and interest some people. But I also know streaming is more about the personality than the video game. So it's like, you know. Where to? Can't be like, ah, the video game can hold up the stream. I'm just gonna sit back and play it. No chat. Us. Uh, no. It makes it a little hard to stream, though, sometimes. You know, it's like... I, I played the game... People don't really care about it. You know, I can't. <laughs> I can't be a funny man all the time. I can't be like, Welcome back. She's got so much weight. You know. <laughs> Pulp pistol. I don't need that. But yeah. It can be a little, it can be a little tough sometimes. Just, just a little bit. But I don't blame people. I'm not like, why aren't you talking about the game more? What? You know, <laughs> that's just how people are. They, they'll talk about it if they're interested, and if not, then they won't. Simple is a simple doo 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 I think people are fine as is. I think people are lovely as is. Um, oh yeah. Essentially, it all just boils down to... I can't really talk about... You know... Good rando shit all the time. Sometimes the game needs to pull its weight. Okay, that's interesting. Thank you. Yeah. It's a little tough being a streamer. Lol. Need a ride? Uh, take me to downtown again. But yeah. How how about you? Would you ever become a streamer? You think that's cool? I think if I was ever to uh, redecide, I think I would be a little bit smarter. Be like, nah, I won't stream. I'd rather focus on my other interests in life. And that's how it would go. <laughs> then I'd say, lol. All right. Here we are. Let's go. We're going on up. We're heading on up. All right, everyone. We're in the Sabat headquarters. Or somewhere near it. We're off to go monitor them. I did do streams sometimes. I'm not a. I'm not good at talking to myself. Yeah, I've. I, I've talked to some people like that in the. They said that they can't really function without someone else also being there to talk to. Which is understandable, because it's like, how can you make um, sentences? How can you pull subjects out of the air? I just do it when it comes to uh, games. I'll just be like, yeah, so this is what we're doing. This is how I feel about it. Blah, blah, blah. You know, you just gotta... Simple things that could be, you just grab them and you stretch them out. Like, right now, I have to go kill the Sabbat. But, you know, if I didn't have anyone to talk to, then I would just stretch it out. And I'd say, so we're off to go kill the Sabbat. I don't entirely know why the Sabbat attacked. It kind of feels like, uh, you know, we wronged them in a way. And yet here we are having to attack and do all this stuff. It's pretty crazy. I hope I can do it. You know, I'm not really the best at shooting and uh, I don't really have a whole lot of good experience in this game. Blah, blah, blah. You know, just take something, stretch it out. Take it, stretch it out. 
Oh, that's the guy. Remember that one guy I was trying to kill? Look, it's the boy. Hello. I see the weariness in your eyes. You grow tired of the yoke that us the elders of the Camarilla have thrown on your back. You squander your time. Big head. <laughs> yeah. Your fatty head. And for what? It might be right, but is the Sabbat really a better alternative? How would you waste an eternity? Skulking in the shadows, hiding from the mortal cattle that inhabit our world? On your knees before the Camarilla that would claim themselves your rightful masters? Or would you let the ancients themselves control you with a whim? Once you embrace truth, Kanai, you will see the absurdity of your question. You're absurd, dude. But LaCroix sent me to kill you. Should I defy him and just stay here? No. Entrance to the Sabbat is forged in a crucible. Your strength tempered. Your loyalty steeled. Even one as powerful as you. Your circumstances are... Odd. You must first prove yourself truly free from the bondage of the Camarilla. I could lie to him. Tell him I killed you. Is that what you want? Is that what you want? Yes. The air is rife with the potency of your blood, Knight. Join me and defy your masters. Unshackle the beast within. Allow your true potential to flow freely into the night. Act as the sword of Cain. Be a servant to no one, and a brother to all kindred that have found the truth of the Sabbath. Oh, you mean the ones that eat upon uh, others? Is that the brotherhood you're talking about, dude? This dude's stupid. Uh, I feel like an idiot. Maybe because I am. Well, good news, Iguana Bob. Most of the time, people like idiots who stream. The more you act dumb and silly and crazy on stream, the better you'll do. If you're more like me and you're very anal and you're very, you know, you're very uptight about stuff and you're very lit, you know, the more you risk becoming a lol cow and such. Or just boring in general. But yeah. Uh, big head. Yeah. He do. He do. Is there any doubt in the minds of the city's kindred what slumbers in that corset tomb? Why does your impotent prince relentlessly drive you forward to retrieve it? Greedily, eagerly, he eyes the power within. Corrupt power. Power that must be vanquished. Uh, okay, I joined the spot to accomplish that, but I'll keep my cover for now. You have corrupt power, I changed my mind. After seeing what you did to this girl here, is that your view of humanity in the masquerade? Cowering before and coddling the mortal vassals, it makes me wretch. We are beasts of stronger blood, meant to subjugate the whole of humanity. The only masquerade is that which the elders play on the clueless members of their pathetic Camarilla courts. Their fickle rules of engagement with our food is merely a tool for extorting the young. No, I will uphold the masquerade and the first thing I do is killing you now. Threats? Do you have the strength to stand behind your words He's got a furry time? arm. Can you cut down an this entire army with your own two hands? I would sooner watch you fade to a pile of cinders. Show me your teeth, K-9. Fine, I'll kill the whole lot of you. Bitch! Oh, what the fuck is that thing? See, this guy is making like monsters. I can't allow that to happen.
Oh boy, oh boy. Ah, what the fuck? Man, you people cray cray. Lol. Okay, who's up next? Lol, oop. Lol, oop. <laughs> hey yo, hold up. Who's up here, huh? Those fugly little monsters. Ow, 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 ow. Hey, I'm going crazy over here, don't worry. I do dead. <laughs> Look. Oh. Need blood, need blood. Elder Vite. There we go. Lol, 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 He's dead. There we go. Been running around after naughty cats. Did you get him? Did you grip him? Say, come here. I'm gonna knife your little cats. I'm gonna knife your little bottles. <laughs> so welcome back. Can't join the sabot. I mean, I could have, but I'm a defiant little man. I'm a little, uh, what do you call a little defiant boy? Probably should have bought some uh, blood bags. Yeah, who's the bitch now, bitch? There you go. How many cats? Two cats you want about one's eleven and one's one. They don't get along. Do cats ever do? <gasps> Any fucking day reload the shotgun thinks. Look at them just standing over there. They're like, yeah, we standing. <laughs> Logers. No, let me chomp on you. Loggers! Yeah, shoot, shoot him. <laughs> oh, my guy went swoosh. It's okay, man, it's okay. There we go. You guys be crazy, so cute. Well, it's more like the 11 year old doesn't like the kitten. He's hissing and growling and swiping him because the kitten wants to play and he does not. 
It's a good way for the kitten to learn, though. That, you know, that his shit ain't gonna be tolerated. He needs to lay low. Calm the hell down, you know. It's a good lesson. I like to think. Ah, uh, big cringe moment. Biggest cringe moment ever alive, lol. Hey man, I gotta take some more of your blood, sorry. Okay, that's enough. Get the rest of your fucking humanity, bitch. And I oop, and I oop, and I oop, and I oop. Hope this man's gonna try and stab me. You are my blood pack, bitch. My kin is indoor cat. We've been treating him to some outdoor time in the sun when we were watching him, but he ran outside just now and I had to chase him around until he went back in. Yeah, sweep does need to be put in his place. He doesn't understand boundaries at all. Yeah. It'll be good for him to learn and understand. But that's the cat culture, baby. Oh my god. <laughs> Just fucking murdered him. I freaking went schizo mode on him. Ow. Fucking garbage. Oh! This ain't supposed to be happening to me. Maybe somebody else, but not me. Loggers. I almost fucking died, my god. There you go, whatever. Feeling great again, I'm feeling fantastic. Hey, there you go. Boots' owner passed away and he was a close family friend's pet, so we've adopted him. I love having two cats, but it's... Hard work when they are fighting all the time. Hey, that's like me and my two cats. Zeke is a little bit of a freak and he's running around all the time. And always trying to start shit with Ming. Sometimes Ming gets a little bossy and she's like, yeah, I'm gonna fuck up this little boy. I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. Say ooga booga and shit to him. It's okay. There we go, blood. Logers. Oh, fuck this. Look at that shotgun. Yeah, you're gonna shoot me through a wall, bitch. What the? How do you go through the wall? How do you go through the fucking wall? 
<laughs> get a freaking chomp done. But it's a good thing you took in that cat. So don't worry, cat. You're part of the crew now, honey. Bitch, bitch. There you go. We're fine. We're good. You gotta take this room by room, unfortunately. part above uh, he was only socialized as a kitten with other kittens but after he was four five months he's been on his own until now but he doesn't get that boots does not want to be followed and sniffed at and have his tail booped well then yeah it's a good learning experience zeke has been with ming for quite a few years and he's still a little bit of a rascal He's still a little bit of a freak. I say this as he's sitting in front of me, being like, Yo, you talking shit, dude? You talking smack? Gotta give this cat a little kiss on the head. I think that's probably the best thing with owning a cat. You just give him a little kiss on the head. They're like, yeah, what up? What do you want from me, man? Do you guys ever have to deal with uh, your cat just, you know, they do the whole making muffins thing? You know, like they start clawing you because they're all like, I love you. How do you deal with it? It's like so fucking painful. <laughs> like, I know, I know he's not doing it to hurt me, but it's so fucking painful. He's really like, yeah, come on, man. I'm just going to be a little crazy. Oh, yeah. Boots does it to me all the time. I just grin and bear it. <laughs> I would, but like, he's like, he gets really into it. Like, he really wants to shove his claws into me and rip out some flesh. I don't know. They're crazy like that. I'd read and chat right now, but currently got a fat cat's ass in the way. Boots has really uh, been taken to me. He's worked out. Uh, he can be in my room now and sleep in my bed, and that's where he's happy. Well, good. Sounds like a nice little mature man is what you needed. A little mature boy. I like more mature cats, like, you know. It's always nice to have a kitten. Because then you get to kind of raise them from ground up how you want. But, like, mature cats are very nice. They have an understanding. You don't have to do as much. Oh, this looks like a boss fight. That's not love. You putting up with it is love. <laughs> But I think the reason why they do the whole making a uh, making some good old pancakes, making some muffins on you is because uh, it's what they would probably do to get milk from their mother or something. Oh God! Now he's laying on my arm. Zeke, this my <laughs> my desk isn't for you to have like your little rest salon. He's literally laying on my fucking arm. Here, I'll see if I can... Can I tab out? Sure. Here, one second. You guys ready to see this? 
here. Look. You want to wonder why I'm not doing the fucking game right now? Here. Are you ready? Yeah. Well, never mind. Cat said, hey, you just dropped that on me? Look at this little rascal. <laughs> Look at this little idiot. Zeke, show them how you were laying on my fucking arm. I was, I was doing my whole thing, and then he was laying right here all on my arm. Look at him. But I dropped it. Now look. Oh, God. Hello. Would you like to... He says, I'll go back to your arm, thanks. Zeke. Excuse me. Look at this big boy. Well, that's a cat. That's my cat. This is one of my two cats. He says, hello. I'm a cat. Does it do a dab? I don't think he can do a dab, no. He'd be crazy. Look at this bitch. Look at this barely seeable bitch because the fucking thing can't ugh, see him. Because he's a little dark man. Black cats are a struggle. I'll tell you that much. Like, I don't agree with the whole, you know, black cats are evil or something like that. But, like, they are fucking difficult. Because since they have dark fur and dark hair, right, you'll pet them. Then you'll be like, oh, okay. Oh, I gotta rub my eye real quick. Boom. You now have cat hair in your eyeball for, like, the next five hours. Good luck. And then you can barely see them. So sometimes it's like, uh-oh. Just accidentally booped my cat. So... Now they're flying all over the place. Typically when they've been taken away too early from their mom, they do that. Yeah, Zeke had that issue a whole lot. He, um, he would, uh, even go as far as to, like, if we had a nice soft blanket out for him, he would be, like, uh, on it and he would try and suckle on it. So, he was definitely taken away from his mom too early. I grew up with a black cat. She was real cute. They are very cute. I got a pure black cat, which is Zeke. And then I got a tortoise. Which is me. I don't want to be like too offensive or anything. But. Ming is like ideal cat. I, I love that cat. Ow. A vampire down. Woman down! A woman down! Still shooting at me. Back to Pimpstall. Stop shooting me! Oh shit. Oh shit, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Straight up. I'm gonna die. Oh, yeah. 
get presence dominated, bitch. Gotta flip, flip the flip. Gotta flip the floop, dip the doop. What up, homie? Being a turdy? Oh, yeah, she's a uh, forty. I mean, not a turdy. Turtle, no, tortoise. Turtle shell is typically only seen in female cats. It's usually brown, orange, and white. Yeah, she only has white on, like, the underside of one of her paws. So, she's just kind of like a peanut butter and chocolate mix, you know? Yeah, that's right. This insane man has cats. What about it? I didn't even get to choose these cats. These are cats that my mom had. Then she was like, yeah, I'm done. Wanna well, know what the funny thing is? She now has two new cats. At least it seems like she's willing to take care of these ones. The new ones she has. Still pretty shit. I got basically forced to take care of these little monsters. It's kind of like, you know, I got freaking pregnant. It wasn't even my own choice become pregnant now I have to raise these kids that I didn't even want make sure I love them now who's who's the why why wasn't I ever given a chance to have my own cats Oh, he just shot his own bro. Oh, that's fucked up. And I'm dead. Why didn't your mom cat? I don't know. She has this thing where she likes to get new things. And then... It's like, oh, sorry. Sorry, uh, I'm done doing effort. Lol. Lol! So, at least that's what I imagined was the whole reason, the excuse. That's what I can imagine. It's just a whole bunch of air. I give up. Hey, I'm done. Turtle. Sweep is all black and crazy. Boots is black and white. Yeah. Sounds like you got basically my situation. I love cats. They make great companions, but they are kooky. I much prefer cats to dogs. Dogs are just a little bit too rambunctious. And plus, it's. For me, it seems like. At least when it comes to dogs. The love isn't... Like... Love isn't earned, it's just given. And I don't like that. I wanna feel like I have to earn it a little bit. No reward given freely was ever great. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. I often find, though, that you are the pet, not them. True. I could never give my fur babies away. They are a lifelong commitment. True. I kind of fear a little. Because my one cat, Ming, she's a bit older. And, you know, she's still probably very far away from, you know, becoming too old, but... It's still very scary. 
because I honestly don't know what I would do. I have a big Ophira. I'm not too sure I would handle it too good. TBH. Listen, man, calm down. <laughs> okay, man, you know what? You win. You win, man. <laughs> no! That's the sad thing. They live short lives, but the best lives. I cried for a month when my cat died. I was in pieces. Yeah, last time uh, I had a cat that was dying, uh, I didn't even go with him to have him put down. Because he had feline leukemia virus. I don't know. Something in me was just like, nah, I can't do it. Can't do it, won't do it. Hopefully I'll be stronger by time Ming comes to uh, that time in her life. I can only hope and pray that I will become stronger upon that day. Thank you. And plus, I, I kind of feel like I don't know. It'll just become an endless cycle of like... Oh, this cat died. Time to get a new one. Because that's what immediately happened. I told my mom I don't want any cats for like right now. She just went out and got another cat. And it's like, great, thanks. Told you I, I don't want a cat, you know. Of course, I love Ming now, but... At the time, it's like... You know, I feel very hurt. I feel very lost. You know, I I want another cat just right away. Then again, I guess that's the only thing you really can do. People do be dying sometimes. True. Cats, animals, everything eventually dies. I like to think of come to terms with death a lot better than lately not lately than before but there's still times where it's like you know i feel deeply affected i'm a very sensitive big boy Yeah, I feel emotions. What about it? There's no one on that side. By the way, should probably save sometime. Would I, uh... I was in work. I tried to make it out of work to get to the vet in time. But I was about five minutes off. I even cried when my foster kids found homes. When my kitty passed away, I couldn't deal with it. I'd deal with another one for four years. It was too heartbreaking. That's how I felt. But I'm starting to think maybe that was a good thing. my cats now even though I didn't want them at first mm -hmm. 
Shit, piss. Ass. All right. Well, we'll have to do that tomorrow. Because it's about the two hour mark. Lol. Uh, I think four years was too long, but my mom was reluctant. That's fair enough, you know? I think too early or too late can be a little uh too tough, you know? But, uh, alrighty. I love you all. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, later tonight will, of course, be the 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 game. It's gonna be Bug Fables, so tune in for it. I don't know. I love you all. Toodaloo and bye bye, bye bye. I love you.